Welcome to another Plan With Me video and in this video I'm going to show you the Professor Nico collection and you already have got a first impression and um, now let's do the plan with me from October the 19th to 25th. So here is my sticker set. On the right you can see the Professor Nitro collection and here are some of the stickers, um, very functional and some decorated. And you can see the inside out sticker book. Um, I love the movie so I thought I include the characters here. And here are some of the washi tapes I may or may not use, I'm not sure yet. Right now I feel they won't fit perfectly so maybe I switch there to another washi tape. So first of all let's put the box headings as I always do and um, yeah we put them here on top. I usually st start with to do and um, put them here on the top but it you know it's kind of hard to put stickers from my perspective so um, I guess I need to get the pages out here so we can put them better. Let's do that. Yeah, I hope you can still see that all that I bet. Um, so it's easier to put my box headings now here on the edges. And um, start, as I said, with a to-do list. Of course, I want to put everything I need to, I have to get done first. And um, then on the next row, I put the little things because if I need to spread on top, I can go there. And on the bottom, I put other stuff. And then also my hobby. For example, I like to go swimming. That's what I put there. And then I start to put the checklists here. As I said, I put the most important thing there. So I can check that off quickly. So I don't care about the color. So I mix it up yellow with green or red or blue. Doesn't matter to me. I just wanted to have something colorful, not all orange and uh, black and beside that you should be able to use this collection over the entire year not just in October That's why I have added it like that And um, Now we're going to put the meal planner stickers. I made them very small I just usually need a word or two. Maybe I want uh, you know pasta or something and then I write it on it and put it on the bottom it's right it's okay for me but as always I notice that it doesn't really fit like this because there are always the words looking through um, which are there I'm glad they are gone in the news edition and um, you know you can put there whatever you want it doesn't really work so you need to use washi tape and um, I have now added a yellow washi tape to my stash because I have the hope that it fits to the rest. So let's see, I need to cut it with my ruler. So let's get the ruler. And then when I have the washi tape added, I can easily put um, the meal planner sticker there and the words won't shine through. I often use tip X to get rid of these words and put them on it and then you know you couldn't see them as well. So it's good they are gone in the next edition and you can do with that area whatever you want to because there is not so much space that you can waste it. Okay let's put some die cut boxes. I like that because it's always a highlight if you put that in the middle and then we put some half size boxes with other stuff and I can write on them that's a good thing always and um, something for decorative purposes so I'm really getting a little bit here over the edge maybe but I like um, to have different stickers here of course if I put the half size boxes on another and there's just green uh, in the middle 
there's not much difference you can write on both it just uh, for when you look at them actually and also here some of the washi tape I put them in, in the boxes and then decorate with that just to have it uh, you know looking like an ending and then something new starts And then, of course, the inside out characters. I just want to have them there. So let's see what's inside the book. I'm uh, thinking of uh, Joy, little girl who stands for Joy. Um, she makes me happy, so I have to add her to my uh, planning this week. So let's put her there. It's so easy to get them out. And uh, I think I want to have them somewhere on the left of the page. So let's see. Maybe I can cover some of these um, little dots there so they don't disturb so much. And I also don't want to cover my boxes because I have to write on them. So um, that should work just fine now. And um, yeah, let's keep adding some fun stuff thinking about more washi but then I don't really know where maybe on the top of the page or here over the dots I'm not sure I think I will forget about that for now um, let's see what else we can do uh, to make this page look nicer you see yeah don't you think that needs another a little sticker from the book here a little angry boy <laughs> he needs to be on the bottom of the page these are not so big that's why I'm going to choose them actually but you know you can be really flexible about that I just need really small stickers for that so I can include these characters and make that look really nice. And now let's get to the second page and add something there. So I guess I need to add the box headings again. And um, then I start to decorate usually because then I can put the die cut boxes much easier. That's why I first usually start with these. And behind that for my brain I have um, a separation of what I have to do and what I can do and um, for me that also fit into the decoration purpose of course somehow I don't know really how uh, this makes sense but for me it does it you know I just want to have it um, everywhere uh, the decoration I just want to have it where there's not much uh, stuff for uh, for business so as you may see or not most probably you can't I put uh, the washi tape on the bottom of the page again and um, then um, I can put the meal planner sticker there because of course you need to have the meal planner stickers also from uh, Thursday to Sunday um, and I choose to have white and black here okay so rest are the box headings and from Monday to Friday it's actually the same but on the weekend I switch a bit I want to add some more hobby and some more little things or other stuff it's not about work on the weekend although I do work a lot I prefer not to have tons of um, work related stickers there because I really you know want to uh, plug out but usually it doesn't work for me but I try I try so so let's put some of the die cut boxes you see I cover the top of of them as well because of that actually so I don't have to put the tutor sticker or anything else there it's not all about what I should do or I have to do it's all about what I want to do um, but then I of course I do things so that's why I put them here 
and then I put washi tape in between or to do box here whatever and then decorate the whole page or the rest of the page so it fits both left and right and then another character the sorrow I like her she's cute in the movie you first don't like her but then you slowly start to like her actually because she's a nice person and she has a right to be there you need to be sad sometimes so that's why I like her character as well I'm not really sure where to put her because this is pretty big but she has to be there Now let's, you know, let's put her on the left or so. Okay, I think there she fits well. I need to write really small for the meal planning for those days. But okay, that will work. So, um... That little woman as well so I have all four of them included that's what I wanted and now um, yeah that's it I think I might keep on adding some more stuff like the weekend banners but right now I don't get the hang on it so for now I will keep it there and post uh, the finished week later um, and I can also add some weather stickers I know what weather will be on Monday and Tuesday, but uh, for the rest of the week, you know, it's kind of hard to say that's how it will be. So um, I just include those two days and uh, we'll keep adding as well as writing. So the completely finished layout won't be ready before the 25th, I guess. That's every week like that. Yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this plan with me video and um, I will see you in the next one and you know don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can get an update for that and um, we let you know once we have a new video up and running and there are many videos every week for an hour channel so please stay tuned I hope to see you there and bye